Introducing Sentinel Spine, the company offering the most studied and clinically proven disc replacement technology in the world. Beginning with clinical usage in 1990, in over 30 years of use, ProDisc has become the most studied and widely used total disc replacement in the world. With over 540 published studies, the ProDisc C total disc replacement is an FDA approved spinal implant intended to reconstruct a diseased intervertebral disc in the cervical spine and is indicated for patients suffering from intractable symptomatic cervical disc disease, or SCDD, at one level, between C3 and C7. The ProDisc C is a ball and socket implant that is composed of two cobalt chrome alloy end plates and a polyethylene insert. The polyethylene insert is affixed to the bottom end plate, forming the ball, and a polished dome in the top end plate forms the socket. All bone contacting surfaces of the ProDisc C implant have a plasma spray titanium coating to promote bony on growth, providing long term implant stability. The ProDisc C implant is secured to the vertebral bodies above and below the disc space and held in place with two central keels. The implant components work together with the surrounding spinal structures to provide stability and function. The ProDisc C is a zero profile implant that does not contact soft tissue structures after it is implanted. First, an incision is made in the neck at the location of the diseased disc and the soft tissues are moved away from the front of the diseased disc. The surgeon then performs a discectomy and remobilization, removing the diseased disc and releasing pressure on the surrounding nerves and spinal cord. Once the disc space is cleared and the segment is remobilized, a trial is used to assess the implant size and position within the disc space. Next, keel channels are prepared in the vertebral bodies above and below the disc space. The keel channels for the ProDisc C implant can be prepared using either a milling technique or a chiseling technique. In the milling technique, a milling bit is used to create the channels for the ProDisc C keel. The chiseling technique utilizes two chisels to create the keel channels. First, the primary chisel is inserted over the trial and advanced into the vertebral bodies. Then, the step is repeated with a secondary chisel to remove any remaining bits of bone from the keel channels. Both the milling and chiseling instruments are designed to ensure that the final placement of the implant precisely matches the placement of the trial. After the keel channels have been prepared, the vertebral bodies are ready to be implanted with the ProDisc C implant. The implant is attached to the inserter, the keels are aligned with the keel channels, and the implant is inserted on block into the vertebral bodies. The instruments are removed and the final implant placement is confirmed. <laughs>